Hello and welcome to another video. In this video, we're going to be covering the three different variations you can do when going to the back court for your footwork. Make sure you watch till the end of this video to master these footwork variations and apply them in your game. Starting off on the forehand side, the first variation is the right left right step. This is the most basic step and many beginners are taught this first. As you can see, you're doing a right step, crossing over with your left foot, then another right step, and then doing a switch step and going back to the middle. This is also not the quickest step, so I wouldn't recommend doing this too much unless you're trying to conserve energy or just hit the shot back. The second variation is a two-step jump. You will start with a small hop into a big hop where you try to catch the shot early. As you can see in this one, we're not doing a switch step because we're catching it much early and the goal is to hit the shot earlier and surprise our opponents. This is a much more commonly used footwork because you can get to the shot earlier and it's much more smooth afterwards. And finally, the third variation is a single jump. All you're doing here is bracing yourself, then launching yourself to the corner from the middle. This is good for the low hanging shots or shots that you're trying to cut off earlier and win the point. On the backhand side, we also have three variations. The first most common variation is the sumo hop, where you step out with your back foot first, do a small hop while turning your body, and then pushing yourself off and getting to the corner. After hitting the shot, you'll do a switch step and hop back to the middle. Most players are taught this when they're starting badminton because it helps you turn your body and generate power when you're hitting the shot. The second most common footwork is a turn into a right left right step. This is more simple for beginners because you're not adding in that small hop and instead all you're doing is turning your body then doing a right left right step. Again, this helps you generate power as you're already turning your body and it's much more simpler than the first one though it is a little slower. And finally, we also have a single jump on this side. Again, all you're doing is pushing yourself off to the back corner, landing with your dominant foot still in front so you're not really turning your body. This is great for cutting off shots or winning rallies with a surprising shot. And those are all the backcourt variations for footwork that you can do to improve your game. Are there any other footwork variations you know of or you want to hear about? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching another video and I hope to see you all in the next one.